Okay, good afternoon everybody. Um, you'll be able to see in the background there that I am at St Andrews Stadium, home of Birmingham City Football Club. Um, Wayne Rooney has literally just um, just taken over um, managing um, Birmingham City Football Club. Well, when I say literally just, it wasn't like just now, um, but he's the new the new manager of Birmingham City Football Club. Um, so I've, I've come here obviously to, to get a drone video of the stadium. Um, it will be a bit difficult. I'm not sure. I'm really not sure where to take off and land from at the moment. Um, it's quite a busy area, so I'm going to have a little walk around, see if I can find any any good points um, that will enable me to to get the drone in the air and try and get the the full stadium in. Uh, but yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll do my best. Um, we'll get up in the air and take a good look at it. Um, it's a lovely looking stadium, it really is. It's a, it's a nice looking stadium, like so. Yeah, we're going to get up in the air, see what we can catch. Let's get up there. St Andrews is a football stadium in the Bordersley district of Birmingham, England. It has been the home ground of Birmingham City Football Club for more than a century. From 2018 to 2021, it was known for sponsorship reasons as St Andrews Trillion Trophy Stadium. Constructed and opened in 1906, to replace the Munts Street ground, which had become too small to meet the club's needs. The original St Andrews could hold an estimated 75,000 spectators, housed in one grandstand and a large uncovered terrace. Between 1906 and 1939, it was reported that a lot of construction work took place inside the ground and the official capacity was set at 68,000 at the start of the 1938 and 1939 season. The attendance record, variously recorded as 66,844 or 67,341, was set at a 1939 FA Cup tie against Everton. During the Second World War, St Andrews suffered bomb damage and the grandstand, housing a temporary fire station, burned down in an accidental fire. In the 1950s, the club replaced the stand and installed floodlights and later erected a, sm a second small stand and roofed over the open terraces, but there were few further changes. When new owners took the club out of administration in 1993, they began a six-year redevelopment program, during which the ground was converted to an all-seater stadium to comply with the Taylor Report into safety at sports ground, and all areas apart from the main stand were completely rebuilt. The seating capacity of the modern stadium is 29,409. It has function rooms suitable for business or social events, and the club store selling Birmingham City merchandise. St Andrews has been the venue for England international football matches at all levels below the senior national team and for semi-final matches in the FA Cup and finals of lesser competitions. It has played host to events in other sports including rugby union and professional boxing and more recently as stage concerts. St Andrews was the venue for the first use of a penalty shootout to, to determine the winner of an FA Cup match. Right, okay, so there you go, um, everybody. That was the St Andrews Stadium by drone um, with some, some nice uh, facts in there about it as well. Um, to be honest with you, it's a lovely looking stadium. Um, it really is. Great looking stadium. Um, but it's it's so busy um, around here. To, to be honest, I, I didn't really, if I'm just totally honest, I didn't really like or enjoy doing that one. I couldn't wait to finish it. Um, it's just really busy, so the only place I could stand was um, kind of at a junction to get good um, good sight on the drone at all times. And yeah, it was it was just so busy, people beeping at each other, um, going mad. Quite seemed quite an aggressive place, um, to be totally honest. So um, yeah, anyway, do you know what? Um, aside from that though, aside from my drone flying experience, the stadium itself is a fantastic looking stadium, isn't it? It really is. Great club as well. Um, what a great club so um, yeah I hope you enjoyed that guys uh, please like share and subscribe hit that subscribe button for me uh, please it means an awful lot I'll be getting to, to as many as I can so today um, alone I have um, 
been to Wolves. This is the last one I'm doing today. So I've been to um, Molyneux Stadium, home of Wolverhampton Wanderers. Then I was on to the Hawthorns, home of West Brom. Then I was on to Villa Park, home of Aston Villa. And then um, St Andrews, home of Birmingham. So I'm finishing off here for today. Um, I hope you enjoyed that video, guys. As I said, please like, share and subscribe. Hit that button for me. It means an awful lot. Cheers, guys. Take care.